I am Dr. Shalini Verma. I am a consultant obstetrician and gynecologist working in Cloud9 Hospital in Washi. When a lady is in her menstrual phase, the blood that comes out is actually the lining of the uterus which is called the endometrium along with shedding of the blood vessels which have been formed during the menstrual cycle. As a protective phenomenon by the body itself, certain proteins called prostaglandins are released in the lining of the uterine canal. This is to reduce the bleeding and keep it under control. Now when a lady bleeds more than what is normal, that is what we call as menorrhagia or excessive bleeding during periods, the amount of bleeding is more than what these coagulatory system can control. Hence, the woman complains of larger clots being passed along with the menstrual flow. Small clots are part of normal cycle, but bigger clots making the patient uncomfortable and painful. And pain during menses, what we refer to as dysmenorrhea, which is worsening with each period, can be pathological. In such cases, we have to investigate what the cause is. It could be anything related to the uterus, like large fibroids or adenomyosis, where the bleeding is excessive, or it could be related to the ovarian factors, where hormonal ovarian cysts can cause these. Even thyroid-related problems can cause excessive clotting and heavy bleeding.